definitely take a couple hits from Rob, and we're taking this to Battlefield. Uh, this is, yeah, okay, I like this stage. Honestly, that makes a ton of sense. Gambling stage. Yeah, yeah, For yeah. real, both of these characters get so much off of Battlefield. It makes a lot of sense for you to start for game one. Let's get right into it. All right, both these players starting off the okay. gate. Leon trying to start off. There we go. Starting off the dash attack from Dill. There he goes. Like 16%. Okay. We're, we're, we're just watching the top. Dreidel, Dreidel. <laughs> we're playing a nice game. Leon, all right. Nice firing back with the fire breath there. Nice finding that grab. Here we go. This is the damage we're talking about. Nair into up air. There's so much damage from Bowser. Bowser does so much damage. Can we talk about this? Hey, like, it's not even just the damage. Oh my god, are we serious? So we got the kill. Are you serious? First blood snatched it away is immediately. Stock the one. First 30 seconds. It is the first stock winner semis. Come on, Leon. Are you serious? We're trying to watch some sets here. We got to have a game. Oh, okay. That's just how he plays. But Dill is an, an ample opportunity to return that stock as well. When you consider how vertical this stage gets with the two layers of platforms and the fact that both of these characters do anything but struggle to kill off the top. Oh yeah. I will not be surprised to see if Dill manages to get herself back onto even ground soon enough. Yeah, very good stuff to Leon putting this lead already, but now you're at 120 cent against Rob. You gotta be careful. Oh my gosh, the chase. Amazing DI from Double, you're getting chased again. It, it's just Bowser like the up air is being come, thrown out for Leon is insane pressure. This guy, it, you wouldn't think his character is a heavy. Like the way he's moving right now, the kind of pressure we're seeing, this is like reminiscent of Falco. This is insane. This is this is a New York Bowser if we're talking about it, man. Nah, this is New Jersey's own pride and joy. The way that Leon is able to contest any type of opponent, any type of play style, he just sort of do his own thing. This guy. I mean, he's been kind of on the sleeper lately, but he's still very much, I mean, just barely get, newly getting sponsored, and he, he's showing he's earned it, man. I mean, already up three stocks, one against Dill. This side B might take it. Oh, just barely missing the top platform. 118% on Rob. Dill is just kind of struggling to close the stock here, and that's everyone's struggling to close out stocks against Bowser. We see that, too, that up to taking it 118. We got our three first stock. three stock at top eight. Oh, Delivered to you by Leon. That is very insane. I mean, Leon showing his knowledge of his options. Literally, like, the, the size of Bowser's moves against a character like Rob. Like, we make the jokes, right? Haha, <laughs> Rob's big. But hey, this is a matchup that really goes to show that's something that the Rob player has to worry about. Oh, in yes. spite of how well Dill is able to maneuver Rob, just occupies space in a way where Rob does not move fast enough. Mm -hmm. And Bowser's just able to put out those big hitboxes. Yeah, you've definitely got to be careful here, because, like, there's a Bowser tends to struggle in a lot of matchups like where he can't safely use his moves and use his options. This is one of those matches where he can kind of do that, right? So the running speed comes into play. We have the, the size of his hitboxes dealing with Rob. And now, as we go, we go into Talent City. This is, I, I'm liking this. this We're ramping up Dale. the silliness. There we go. Honestly, an excellent stage choice, but it's one that can go awry so fast, regardless of who maintains that control. Playing off the plots, pivotal with this stage because you have that opportunity to make more laterally oriented combos that will normally just sort of be nice damage and good stage control, potentially lethal. Oh, wait a minute. Back with the laser, there we go, Dill starting out. Amazing, you're talking about Silius. First stock, first game, we start off the top, now we're going straight down to the bottom. Dill showing up amazingly in stock one of game two. What a show out. Oh my gosh, there we go, but still Leon finding that side B there, trying to catch Dill on the back foot here. Yeah, this is going to be hard to come back from Rob, but Leon showing absolutely no confidence faltering here. Uh, using that up, he had a shield there. That grab is going to be hard to come back from the side of Town and City because one Bowser Ford closes out. Yep, this is the danger zone right here. 45 seconds into Town and City coming out, and all of a sudden you have those platforms that extend so close to the ledges. Now, Leon don't need none of that. Back there from center stage manages to tie up the stock count. But it remains to be said that both of these characters, because of how their combos bring themselves towards the ledge so quickly, can extend onto the platform so easily and can kill so quickly. This is going to be a fast game too, Momo. Oh my gosh, this entire set's going so fast. I'm absolutely loving it. Leon trying to put the pressure on the ledge there with the down B, catching the roll in from Dill. And this lead, this game is already in Leon's favor. I mean, after that quick start from Dill, Leon's still having the adaptation. Nice grab there from Dill, though. He's going to close it out. And just, who does that? That was such a master option. I can't even say that was pro That was such a master option. Come on. <laughs> I, I don't even know what to say about that. Like, hey, listen. If you think your Bowser does that and gets away with it, it doesn't. Leon, though, 
Leon's diffy, Sometimes bro. it doesn't either. But honestly, it's, He's diffy. it's such a good option when you consider that, like, no one's going to react to that the first time around. It's such a bad option. Who would do that? That's such, like, a, like a, like a bad player. Like, if you saw someone, like, like an O2 or do that, you'd be like, oh, my gosh. Predictable. You see Leon do that? Oh, my gosh. He's no, so it's, smart. It's truly the bell curve of skill. You've got the genius option at the bottom, the genius option at the front. You've got everyone doubting it all the way through. It's the eye, though. I mean, 171%. Just barely missing that down air. Leon is holding up for dear life. Again, 179. That high ceiling of Town and City coming to bite Phil in the butt right now. It's going to be tough. Wait, a side B clinking with that Dowser up B. Oh, no. Now you're on the side of the stage against Bowser once again. Leon literally needing one single aerial from Bowser, and this could close up this game. As I say that, too, that forward area is going to do it. Leon putting himself up 2-0 in the set very quickly, too. Oh, my gosh. Mile a minute game. That's what I came here to see, and that's what Leon delivered. Leon is completely ripping away any opportunity Dill could have had to mount a comeback. Oh, my gosh. That nair to back air. That's a, you know that's true, right? Nair to bear. That's, mm -hmm. that's such an insane combo. Leon is so the good. The SDI window for that Nair is so tight for a character like Rob. You gotta be one, pristine with your SDI. 125? You, you died at 125? Come on, man. That was like, they were literally just expecting literally anything but that. Uh, I'm assuming DI wasn't all there. But now we are in game three. Still showing that signs of life in that game. Too. Showing that this is definitely doable for her. She can do this. And we're going back to Tennessee. I'm liking the stage trick here. But you still got to be careful because you, you definitely have to try to use abuse Rob and not give Leon that time of day to somehow make it back in the set. Well, in spite of how good of buttons Rob has, it's much easier said than done to uh -huh. take advantage of this character. When you consider how confidently Leon swings at every opportunity, even a disadvantage, man just finds his damage and finds his mark and kills. Oh, yeah. I mean, 95% absolutely nothing to scoff at. Oh, getting caught on that platform. Absolutely uh, redoing the juice. Nice stuff from Dill. Still getting caught on the Oh, my gosh. Shout hey, out to back here. Leon, come on, bro. He's slow down now. I saw the vision, but... We can't get too crazy there. Catching the air dodger, the side B is going to 80%. That's the Town City shenanigans we are looking for. Amazing stuff for Dill. And still taking the lead back. She's still in this game. She's still in the set. Oh, uh, oh. Look at you, did. Oh, my God. You did that. You know what? I'm just going to be quiet, guys. Frank, you got this, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh. There we go. Now Dill trying to get this already started back home with these gyro combos. Okay, nice tech on the platform. Still getting called up with the side B. Dill is looking amazing Yo, right now. Remix. What is happening? All right, she's pressing all the buttons. She's trying to make it happen. Embrace Zamba. Just <laughs> press buttons. Just pulled forward. <laughs> the kid ain't here to match. Someone has to do it. Somebody has to match for this region. For the sanctity of New York City. We press got, them buttons. We got buttons to press. Oh. Dill trying to go to the soccer. Nice get up attack from... Leon, there we go, Nair into up air, not going to take him, he's looking for another option. Nice landing with that Nair, calling out Leon, getting a too over-aggressive there. And up air, still not going to take it, even from all the way up there. Twitter also not going to take it, but putting Bowser in such a bad position, going straight through the giant. Uh, that was maybe the grossest use of up air that I have ever seen from a Rob, and that is coming from someone who has had to watch Dill for years, and has seen what so many other Rob players can do. Drag down up air is just straight up a sin, but I don't think I've ever seen it Lead to a delay, miss tech off the lip. This is defend the North 22 top. Like this is insane plays. Dill wants to stay in. This does not want to go down 3-0 against Leon. And still nice DI there, hanging on from that Bowser side beat. Leon just looking for an open card close to the stock. And now you're a stock up against Rob, and that might take it. But still, you're at 43%. Dill looking as clean as ever. This is still definitely in the rebel possibility. Dill is looking like they can clinch out this game. Oh. I mean, you got to remember that a player of Dill's caliber, like, she's seen plenty of Leon before. Oh, plenty yeah. of players like Leon. Holding forward and finding victory is something that she's no stranger to. And it's something that, you know, she could do quite a lot of, too, because this has been a much more active game than the previous two. And oh! she's adapted so well. Did you see that up smash? Oh, my God, he went for the F smash. forward smash? Yo, Leon, is this, is this, did someone switch out to Leon for, like, a, like a Wi-Fi Bowser? Like, what's going on, dude? First the down no, air, no, 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 the no. F smash. What's that happening? The, that's the blueprint. <laughs> he was you a got a problem with how Bowser's play? You got this man to blame. Yo, okay, yeah, okay, Leon, like, I got some words after I get off comp, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, he's got gyro in hand. 196. Still has to close the stock out now. Max Rage Bowser is so scary. You have to land here. 
Oh my gosh, literally Leon covering every option right now. The laser is going to get punished. Oh, he wasted that. Oh, but that up air is going to do it at 196. Leon still clutches out. 3 0 win over Dill. Wow. Just fantastically played by Leon. And a 3 0 over Dill is absolutely nothing to oh sneeze my at. Like, gosh. this is a fantastic player. One of the city's finest. Eaten alive by this Bowser. And you know, a little fun fact. I got to drop the Snapple facts. I do it every time I'm okay. on the mic. Leon, previous grand finalist of Defend the North. Oh, yeah. Having placed second at DTN 2019. So it looks like he's trying to move himself along to putting himself right in grands for yet another DTN. He's back to claim his throne, and I fully respect him. But he's got, he's got a challenge, though. He has to go through MPG. The audacity to show this stock again. That was, that was dirty. I promise y'all, I did not press that button. <laughs> nah, I, I'm, I'm glad to see it again, but oh my gosh. Leon's awareness of all his options, like, Bowser is such, like, you would never think of a character to, like, cover so many options, like, to be Bowser, right? But Leon, literally, that the, the speed of this character and the movement he has with his aerials, like, still literally could go nowhere there. You went, you, you drifted in from the side, you got forward air. You came in from the top of the platform, you got up air. You go to ledge, you get F-tilted. Bowser like, just, just punches you. Yeah. Boom. It's a lot to deal with at once, Pop. but... Rob just doesn't have the speed to really surmount that. You could try to match that tempo. You, mm -hmm. you try, but there's such a misalignment in the way that the character's kits flow. Yeah, yeah. That, like, yeah. even if you do try to emulate such a ru like, rush reckless style, it's not going to work out as well. And I do think Dill was able to, you know, match those footsteps a bit in game three, but that's, that's Leon Bowser we're talking about. It's